Do you mind if I hit record on the just on my video or not the video the um sound? Oh yeah, I'm gonna yeah. <laughs> so I have friends who this they were able to capture. I'll see if I can find it in Texas. There was some kind of a storm like this, and they took a picture of the lightning storm, and they didn't even notice it. But the lightning flashed at the right time. They took the photo. What is that? And you can see a giant monster in the sky. Yeah. Like, why is it rumbling I'll, I'll send like it that? to you. Hear that? Yeah, that's that's not thunder. That's no. spiritual warfare. Because th thunder would be like crack, and then <laughs> right? Because he just lost his jurisdiction. Here. Oh, that is so weird. Crazy, huh? Rushed to Abba, rushed to Abba, rushed to Abba. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Do the true Almighty God. You are the true and mighty God. Ayos, 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 Rushed a rockerio mukoya. Mukoya, here a higher. Mukono, Ian a Kayan a Kayan a Kayan a Kayan a
Na Istennek kérjél a rekharra, Isten! I cried out to God with my voice, to God with my voice, and he gave ear to me. In the day of trouble, I sought the Lord. My hand was stretched out in the night without ceasing. My soul refused to be comforted. I remembered God and was troubled. I complained and my spirit was overwhelmed. Selah. You hold my eyelids open. I am so troubled that I cannot speak. I have considered the days of old, the years of ancient times. I call to remembrance my song in the night, and I meditate within my heart, and my spirit makes diligent search. Will the Lord cast off forever, and will he be favorable no more? Has his mercy ceased forever? Has his promise failed forevermore? Has God forgotten to be gracious? Has he in anger shut up his tender mercies? Selah. And I said, this is my anguish, but I will remember the years of the right hand of the Most High. Hallelujah. The right hand of the Most High is Yeshua. I will remember the works of the Lord. Surely I will remember your wonders of old. I will also meditate on all your work and talk of your deeds. Your way, O God, is in the sanctuary. Who is so great a God as our God? You are the God who does wonders. You have declared your strength among the peoples. You have, with your arm, Yeshua, Yehushua HaMashiach, redeemed your people the sons of Jacob and Joseph. Selah. The waters saw you, O God. The waters saw you, and they were afraid. The depths also trembled. The clouds poured out water. The skies sent out a sound. Your arrows also flashed about. The voice of your thunder was in the whirlwinds. Hallelujah. Yes, the waters saw you and they were afraid. Yes, that is the kingdom of Satan, the kingdom of this world, or the marine, all the marine kingdom, Atlantis or whatever some people might refer it to that have um, spiritual eyes to see the powers and principalities that um, are around them that... Um, dwell under the waters which is why it says in revelation that there will be no more sea and why yeshua makes us fishers of men and causes scales to fall off of eyes to be able to see the truth the way the truth and the life the light and he says that he has thrown our sins into the depths of the ocean, back where they came from, back into those waters of hell and the flood of judgment that is coming for those who don't repent and believe in the Savior, Jesus Christ of the Holy Scriptures, Yahushua HaMashiach. And we can't understand that unless we come out of this world and the harlot church. He will darken our understanding until we obey him and obey the last thing he has told us to do, revealed uh, through his Holy Spirit, through his written word, the scriptures. And boy, it's been a humbling journey, this second exodus, and a lot like the Israelites did. <laughs> um, well, we are Israel. We've, we've taken the long way around, but God has used what the enemy meant for evil, for good, for the accomplishing of the saving of many lives, just as with Joseph. You know, it only geographically, if you look at a map, should take six months to cross the wilderness um, that the Israelites crossed when making their exodus 
out of Egypt and Pharaoh was uh, chasing after them. But it took them 40 years because, um, well, we're sinful. We carry sin and rebellion um, in our blood from Adam. And uh, praise Yah. As David said, it was good for me that I was afflicted, that I might learn your statutes and learn obedience by suffering so that um, we may be disciplined and, and saved and kept for the kingdom of heaven and eternal life and perfect oneness with Yahuwah. Okay, where was I in the psalm? For the sky sent out a sound. Your arrows also flashed about. Thank you, Abba. Your voice, the voice of your thunder was in the whirlwind. The lightnings lit up the world. The earth trembled and shook. Your way was in the sea. Your path in the great waters. And your footsteps were not known. You led your people like a flock. By the hand of Moses and Aaron. <laughs> so I don't know what that sound is that we've been hearing um, after the thunder, but I suppose um, I suppose it was Yah, um, because this is the psalm that he asked me to read as I was um, praying um, in tongues just now. So... This is the last call. Climb aboard the Ark of the Covenant. Obedience to his law. Made possible by the fulfillment of the law. By our advocate and defender, Jesus Christ. Yehushua HaMashiach. Hallelujah. God bless you.